Words on a printed page offer readers knowledge and experiences well beyond their own. The printed word, however, has fired me with ambition to one day be a master printer with my own printing office. How shall I, Franklin Baxter, obtain an education? Learn a trade of a good master. I'm now in my third year as an apprentice at Mr. Miriam's printing office. Printing is a complicated trade that takes a long time to learn. I started by just watching my master at work, and then by doing. I think that I work hard, but he says I am no busier than a hen with one chicken. An apprentice starts with simple tasks and the jobs that no one else wants to do. But I'm gradually learning to set type. It's the most complicated and important of a printer's skills. When I finish my apprenticeship, I can become a journeyman printer like Daniel Leonard, who came to this office from New Hampshire. A skilled printer can earn good wages. Most journeymen try their luck at several different printing offices. It takes years to save enough for your own shop and equipment. Luckily, there are printing offices all over New England. I might find work in a small town like Brookfield, or in larger places like Springfield or Worcester. Or I might try Boston. My education in the printing office has gone beyond the skills of the trade. I'm surrounded by books and newspapers. I've learned a lot of new words and expanded my ideas of the world. I love the look of a well-printed page. Printing isn't just a business, it's a trade in words and ideas. Sometimes I think about Benjamin Franklin. My parents named me after him. He started as a printer's apprentice and became a great man. Perhaps one day, I will too. <laughs>